This is a short tutorial on how to use the edge blending feature of Resolu Marina. Edge blending is used to make one seamless projection out of two or more projectors. It's a combination of hardware and software, so the first thing to do is to line up your projectors as good as possible. For good results, make sure you have at least 15% overlap between each projector. The bigger the overlap, the smoother the blend will be. Then, in Resolume, create a composition which is as wide as your projection. In this case, we'll be using three projectors at 800 by 600. So just type 800 times 3 for the width, and Resolume will do everything for you. Turn on the test card. Open the advanced output and using the input selection, assign the first slice to the left third of your composition. Use the output transformation to assign this slice to the left third of your triple head output. Duplicate the slice and now assign it to the middle of both the composition and the output. Repeat the process for the third slice, and this time assign it to the right third of your composition and output. Change the names of the slices to help you stay organized. If you're using a graphic card that has multiple outputs, assigning the input selection works exactly the same way. Assigning the output transformations is not necessary in this case. Move the input of the left slice towards the middle until the overlap in composition input matches the physical overlap of the projectors. Repeat the process for the right hand slice. Use the perspective warp mode in the transformation tab to warp the corners of the slices where necessary, to create an overall rectangular shape. You may need to adjust the four corners a few times to get a good result. Now you can turn on the soft edge for each slice and watch the magic happen. Notice you will lose some of your composition output on the sides of your projection. This cannot be helped because your projectors are overlapping and does have less pixels to cover the whole surface. Where necessary, you can use the soft edge parameters to adjust the curve of the soft edge. Also, you can use brightness and contrast adjustments for each slice to match for different projectors.